Miz. Good to see you too, champ. Come on, what's with the boo-boo face? When I'm the one who liberated you from his lordship. I didn't need liberating. Let's skip the pleasantries. You wanted the WWE Universal Champion on SmackDown. Here I am. What I wanted is the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. The champion can be anyone who understands what it means to represent the most must-see sports entertainment show on Earth. You think you're that guy? What I think is that I'm my own man, and the WWE Universe will come along with me or they won't. I'm not doing dog and pony shows for anyone. You might be your own man, but you are playing in my sandbox. And you can play big, bad, counterfeit, stone cold all you want, but you will quickly realize you're just making your life harder. I've never been one for the easy way. Good. That's the perfect attitude for your very first SmackDown main event. Since you were so ready to face Cody Rhodes on Raw, I can only assume you are ready for Kevin Owens tonight. I beat KO in the tournament, and I will gladly beat him again. Excellent! And just a heads up, I might come see your match in person. You know, just an impartial observer to get a closer look at the champion I drafted. Absolutely no other reason at all. See you out there! The following is scheduled for one fall and is for the Undisputed WWE Universal Championship! He's known much more for cold stares than warm welcomes. It's Kevin Owens. I'm sure KO is feeling lucky for the chance to redeem himself after losing focus the last time these two faced off. He must be absolutely salivating at the opportunity to expose the new title holder as nothing more than a paper champion. It's not every day you get a chance to rectify your mistakes this quickly. It's SmackDown's newest acquisition. You gotta give credit to SmackDown general manager The Miz for making sure the blue brand wasn't left without a champion after what happened at SummerSlam. Despite my feelings on the quality of said champion, yes, I agree. Thank you, Miz, for doing a wonderful job. Will the new champion's reign on SmackDown be short-lived? Or is this the start of a long and successful journey? He 
Introducing the challenger from Marieville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin. his opponent from New York, weighing in at 178 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, the Superstar! Everything has led to this. For the undisputed WWE. See no time with his new acquisition. We have a WWE Universal Championship match right here, right now, on SmackDown. I'm smelling a title change here. KO's a hard man to beat. He's even harder to beat twice. Not that he needs it with the title at stake, but Owens will definitely have some extra motivation after losing to the champ in the opening round at SummerSlam. A barrage of lethal strikes. Oh, great. Our GM Miz is here to distract the Dark Horse. He's scouting his new champion. There's a difference. Great wherewithal on the counter. And well-timed maneuver there. Owens running into some trouble. Owens is under the gun. Impressive counter by KO. Misses on the springboard. Oh, vicious right forearm. Oh, what a clubbing blow. Suplexes, slams, and bombs are all painful, but being slapped like that is humiliating. You would know, Saxton. That was one way for the champion to send a message. Will there be a response in kind? Ooh. A flurry of brutality. Stiff kick. He's dictating the pace of this match now, guys. You have to give credit to the steady fight he's giving. Kevin Owens with the evasion. Oh, saw it coming and got an elbow for their trouble. Drop kick finds the spot. With a reversal. Net breaker. The challenger being outclassed here. This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Twisting. Oh, God. A totally ill advised decision there. Maybe slight hesitation there caused the outcome. <laughs> Owens was scouted there. Side and back to the mat. Whoa, leaping through the air. Oh, he retaliates. Defenses are sharp in this series of reversals. Catching a drop kick. Impressive counter by KO. Legs caught. Over the knee right in the face. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Hoisted up on their shoulders. Death Valley driver. Oh my gosh, what impact. Right to the ribs. Punch lands. Attack to the midsection. Back fist. That was nasty. 
caught by the back of the elbow. Trying to put them away, able to counter it. And a close line counter. Certainly able to scrap with the best of them. Case in point. Fails to connect on the springboard. Springboard misses the target. From behind, back suplex with a championship on the line. Breaks the close count. Really had less than a second to stay alive there. Oh, jeez, falling hard to the outside. Drop kick. Beautiful. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Ooh. Able to avoid there. Tornado team. Talk about devastation. Great thinking to stop Owens. Drop kick. Continues the attack on the core. It could prove to be an effective strategy. Taking aim. Owens is a sitting duck. Oh, the stunner. That was the best one I've ever seen. The champ with a show of dominance stealing that move. Boom! Ah, oh, kick. Nasty kick. Owens intercepts it. He got the shoulder up in time. Not even letting the ref get to the two count. Oh, right in the mat, face first. That certainly wasn't pretty. The champ looking out of sorts. And it's like KO only gets more aggressive as the fight goes on. Look out! He gets out of the way. Oh, man, a little extra luster behind that kick. to a dead heat with these reversals. Dropkick hits the mark. Well-placed kick. KO getting rolled up here. And that will do it. Another flash win for the WWE Universal Champion. Wait, what is Miz doing? Interception by the champion. Talk about a backfire. And now KO's begging for mercy. Come on, this is unnecessary. Come on. Chair to the gut. This is an all-out assault. Our GM Miz was the one who introduced the chair in the first place. Maybe he thought the champ needed to take a seat after a tiresome match. We don't know. So how do you explain this? Miz looks like a kid caught with his hand in the cookie jar with that table. So much for being an impartial observer. Run, Miz. Get out of there. Looks like the champion might take advantage of that table Miz set up. Another backfire for our GM. He better not go through with this. And down through the table. Yeah, Kevin Owens.
Rollins is absolutely laid out. Miz tried to involve himself in this match and managed to hoist himself by his own petard. The WWE Universal Champion has come to SmackDown and he's making a statement to Miz, KO, in the entire WWE Universe. Yeah, well, take a look in the Miz's eyes, Cole. That champion's going to regret this. What the hell, Miz? Impartial observer? You were passing chairs, setting up tables. I'm surprised you didn't chuck a ladder at me for good measure. Turns out the situation called for a partial observer. It's what's best for the image of the brand. And that would be Kevin Owens? What does he have that I don't? KO's exciting, unpredictable. Yeah, he's a little rough around the edges, but Maurice has her stylist working on a makeover, and there's this amazing jacket being tailored. Look, the point is, KO has promised to be The Miz's undisputed WWE Universal Champion, and that's what matters. Believing a word KO tells you is your first mistake, and more importantly, I've beaten your poster boy. Twice now. Beaten him with a chair. Put him through a table. You mentioned a ladder earlier. Well, let's go there. At Clash at the Castle, you will put the WWE Universal title on the line against KO in a TLC match. Fine. I'm going to walk into that match with my title, and I'll walk out with it too. No, no, no. You will not walk in with the WWE Universal title because it will be hanging high above the ring, right where it belongs, out of your reach. A lot's changed since the last time we spoke in an empty arena. Indeed. That night I gave you an opportunity, and you took full advantage. I guess. Most everyone in the WWE Universe thinks Roman Reigns won me the title, and KO only beat himself to get me there. There will always be doubters. Every WWE Universal Champion will be in the shadow of Roman Reigns in one way or another. At least until someone can break the record with the title. Well, that's pretty much an impossible goal. Perhaps. My point is that you should take it a step at a time. You'll be the dark horse until one day you turn around and someone calls you the favorite. I think that might be a ways off. I'll just have to keep winning. A dominant victory over Owens tonight will go a long way towards answering that question in SmackDown's locker room, if not with its general manager. Miz can be a real tosser. <laughs> Quite right. But it seems to me that he has also given you an opportunity to prove he and the doubters wrong. That's what being a champion is, huh? A constant battle to prove you deserve your spot at the top of the card. Indeed it is, my boy. Indeed it is.
We're in for a brawl with Kevin Owens tonight. With KO, it's a brawl every night. Introducing the challenger from Maryville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens! Throughout his career, KO has let it be known he will fight anyone, anywhere. Truly, Kevin Owens has no hint of fear in his being. KO has one scary temper, and that's only half of what has made him successful. Yeah, I mean, he's only the 16th freaking Grand Slam champion in history. And there he is, the man who's blazing his trail through WWE. And introducing the champion from New A once forgotten man who is now etched in the annals of WWE history. This is inspiration personified. Sure, but he better be careful or he might find out what happens when an underdog becomes overrated. It usually doesn't end well for them. As the undisputed WWE Universal Championship literally hangs in the balance, the fresh champion looks to prove himself again against Kevin Owens. Well, not just Kevin Owens, it's Kevin Owens plus tables, ladders, and chairs. I'm no mathematician, but that adds up to a bad night for the champ. Both of these men will leave with bruises tonight, but only one will be leaving with that championship. Counter, and now there's an opening. Counter after counter. Oh. Close line. Oh, a slingshot cross body. Absolutely throwing all caution to the wind. Spinning in the face of danger. What a drop kick. This match is spilled out to the ringside area. And as we can see, tension's really running high now. Uh, yeah, we should probably clear the way, guys. Owens gets control. Neck breaker. Ouch. KO is getting knocked around a bit. Owens just can't find any breathing room. Just a step ahead of Owens. Drop kick. No, oh, oh, oh. turn out the lights. The party's over. Uh oh. Clearing the table. Yeah, gonna take it to the next level. What is this superstar thinking? They're thinking about the end. Finishing this thing off by any means necessary. Oh man, look at this. It's like he's got eight arms and feet. Ooh. A flurry of brutality. Look out. He paid for that one. Oh, man. Big time. And that. Whoa! Oh, the high risk doesn't pay off. 
I don't care how bold you are, missing on those kind of maneuvers will send you to a medical facility. A medical attention might be needed out here. That was a nasty landing. Now would be the time for everyone to clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. And some effective offense with that one. It's not looking good for Owens. Owens needs to find an opening. Ooh. Hooked up in a pump handle. And a neck breaker! Yes, that was nasty. He'll take things into the ring. Getting the ladder situated right now. A good spot, too, right in the center of the ring. A counter answered by another counter. Back and forth, back and forth, looking for the advantage here. There it comes. Down across the neck. And he's taking this to the outside now. A rapid shots right to the gut. Oh my goodness. Just strike it at will. Into the corner. This can't be good. And it it with the face. The challenger's hopes are slipping away. He can really stand to get back as good as he's getting right about now. Yeah, Kale will have something new to complain about if things stay this way. He's been complaining about your commentary. Uh-oh. Batten down the hatches. F5! Thunderous! Another one bites the dust to the champ. He's looking to get up that ladder, guys. The long way. He's looking at it here, guys. Victory just a few inches away. Come on. You gotta move quicker than this. For once, I agree with you. Coming back in the ring. Ooh! Ooh. Boom! Oh! With authority! Ooh! He leaves the ring, and there's no countouts in this one. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. He's rummaging for some sort of equalizer underneath the ring. He's got a ladder now. He could be contemplating something very risky. He's heading back to the ring. KO is getting knocked around a bit. Owens just can't find any breathing room. He's looking to align that ladder up perfectly. Placement is crucial. Lethal. Dragon Slayer! Oh my goodness! And breaks the hole, but damage has been done. Oh, oh, it's, it's, down. it's cinched in, this could be over. Well, this won't win the match, but it's looking to free the arm and does just that. Rolling elbow! He isn't finding any space to recover. Yeah, it's to pull out some form of offense here. Looking to snatch a victory here, guys. I think it's gonna happen. Could be just seconds from victory. Closer even. Look at super focus too, Cole. This may very well be it. Got it. And the champ adds to their legacy.
Behold the Nigerian giant. An absolute colossus. When it comes to Omos, there is no preparing. Just brace for impact. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Lagos, Nigeria. Weighing in at 400 pounds. The Nigerian giant, Omos! You are looking at a real-life monster in one hell of a bad mood. Has stood across the ring from future Hall of Famers and decimated them. And decimation is on the menu again tonight. Gentlemen, just take a look at the size of this behemoth. It is a scary, frightening sight looking up at a man the size of Omas. Galloping into history, defying all odds. It's the Dark Horse. And his opponent from New York, weighing in at 178 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, the Superstar! Well, the way this guy stumbled into such good luck and the WWE Universal Championship, let's hope he doesn't stumble down the ramp while he's at it. His title win might have been fortunate, but the longer he holds it, the more you have to admit he's a worthy champ. I don't have to admit anything. To me, he's still got a lot to prove. For a superstar that always has something to prove, his next opportunity starts now. You can see that the champ looks a little relaxed going into this match, don't you think, guys? Well, the relief of not putting your title on the line certainly has to help, Michael. All I know is that with or without the title, full focus is needed on this match. Either way, there's no doubt the champ is ready for a fight. And standing over the entire ring is the all-powerful Omos. This man has to be seen to be believed. It's difficult to fathom the impact of Omos' strength. The power of Omos could be equivalent to half a dozen men. Maybe more. Oh, man. Ooh, stinging kick. Ah, oh, perfect kick. Shifts it back onto him. Something's in store for him. On the least might and force. That just reverberated throughout the entire building. Talk about making a statement. Size there. Boom, what a kick. With the reversal. He is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Saxon. Like it caught. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Set up in the corner of the ring. Looking a little out of it up on that turnbuckle. Now this could be perched on the top rope, looking to inflict even more damage. Oh my God, not from up there. What on earth? Oh my God. Oh, the ring imploded. What in the world? And the official calls it. Clearly, they cannot fight any longer.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. One of the tallest competitors in WWE history. The personification of intimidation. The Colossus has arrived. A true dominant giant. No kidding. I got a neck ache just looking up at him. Omas's stature alone fills his opponents with fear. I feel fear in my soul. And I'm not, I'm not even in the ring with the guy. Towers over the entire locker room, both literally and figuratively. Who in the world can take down this Colossus known as Omas? It's a superstar who couldn't be denied and now electrifies the WWE Universe. It just goes to show you, you can't judge a book by its cover, and you can't judge a wrestler by where they start their career. Match after match, the Dark Horse is turning doubters into believers. The doubts are probably the very thing that fueled him. He really should be thanking those of us who didn't have his back. It's time to silence the critics and make some noise. Introducing the challenger from Lagos, Nigeria, weighing in at 400 pounds, the Nigerian giant, Omas! And his opponent from New York, weighing in at 178 pounds, the undisputed. WWE Universal Champion, the Superstar! There is no prize bigger in this industry. The owner of that title is the alpha of our sport. This is what it's all about tonight. The undisputed WWE Universal Championship. The stakes are higher than ever as Omas challenges the dark horse for the WWE Universal Championship. And we've got to be ready for anything after their last match brought the house and the ring. I've been assured precautions have been taken, so one of these superstars will be the only thing taken down. See ya. into the corner. Looking vulnerable on that top turnbuckle. Shot all the way to the outside. Clearly the champion knows what's at. Uh-oh. High risk cross body. It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. Driven into the... 
just draping his opponent over the barricade. And I shudder to think what's about to happen next from the apron, letting the people know. The referee counted, urging them to get in the ring. And the pressure on Omos continues to mount. Yeah, Omos has to plot a way to get back into this. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Really pushing the limit there. As long as you're aware, use as much of the ref's count as you want. Good Lord, talk about getting drilled. He knows how to avoid contact. Hits the drop kick. Sweet rolling savant kick. Caught him with a big boot. On the mark. The challenger is not in a great place. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Oh, man. Nice drop kick. This is just an overwhelming amount of offense on him. Yeah, and this has to decrease his composure moving forward. Momentum isn't completely out of Omos's side just yet. Now the chance for Omos to get back into this match. Kick lands. On oh, takedown, and now punches rights. Vicious, aggressive attacks. I think rage took over in that moment. Nothing but blind rage. Oh, man. Omos able to counter. And he puts a quick stop to the momentum that was mounting against him. But he still has more work to do to get this fully in his favor. Everything working against Omos now. Omos has to exhibit some resiliency now. He turns it around. Drop kick. Oh, great height. Down with a sling blade. He is looking to do some serious harm. Champ looking to end this. The champion retains. Here is your winner. And still, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Inconceivable. How does this guy keep beating the odds?
Well, if it isn't the champ. This is a fun surprise. They didn't tell you I was coming? Huh. Anyway, just down to do the honors and cut the ribbon on the new Dark Horse ring. The what now? The ring you're naming after me. To inspire the recruits. To do what? <laughs> Get ridiculously swollen heads? I mean, why stop at a ring? Maybe we should rename WrestleMania Dark Horses Wrestling Rodeo. Uh, okay. I think there's been a bit of a mix-up. Yeah. Last I checked, one lucky win doesn't make you wrestling royalty, even if it did happen in a title match. Lucky? You're saying I got lucky? I'm saying you've spent the majority of your time here as a mid-tier superstar. I'm gonna base my opinion of you on that. Not the five minutes you've been champion. No one's taken the title off me yet. Oh, between the parking lot and here? Wow, impressive. I'm not hiding from anybody. Maybe you should. Your luck could run out just as fast as Fortune smiled on you. I mean, no offense, but I'm training guys here who could give you a run for your money. Pick your best one and have them meet me in the ring. Sure. I just hope you can find it without your name being on it. Ah! 